I just like a new tea. Every, I'm oh, really nice. happy. I'm sitting with my friend. Yeah. You both have the same birth dates, which I find is very interesting. Same August 31st. We do. Yeah. I'm, it's curious. <laughs> Why didn't I'm, I know that? Oh, you didn't know that? I knew that. I didn't know it. This okay. is the first. <laughs> you never told me that. August 31st. Well, this I'm is really I... bizarre. That explains so much. Because we're not really Virgos. You're not. You're no. on the cusp. Well, the I don't know what the mix is, but we're not like a normal. Vir He's more like a normal Virgo, actually, than I am. Okay. I know nothing about that, but I'm, I'm, I'm happy to share the birthday with. You. I didn't well, know that. I'm wondering if you two were simpatico. This was actually going to be my last question, but let's do it now. I mean, did you feel? You must feel sort of if you have a similar birthday. It, there's maybe some sensibilities, similar traits. Maybe not. I'm reading too much into it. I think um, <laughs> as far as this film goes. Okay, maybe not. I'm Richard Gere's inner Norman. Okay, well. So I'm, if there is an inner Norman in Richard Gere, then then some of it is is apparently I, on this side of the shot. There's there's no question that the eight or nine months that we spent together. There was a point where you had revealed your inner Norman enough to me that I went, aha, that's where I'm going with this. But you know, I do have to say, just, just for, for the record between us. Please. I think part of the fun of, of working with Norman is that Norman goes further than what I ever would. So there might be something of Norman in me, but I, yeah. I hold it back. In the movie, he just yeah, lets go, which, which is fun. It's great fun. Then you were also were generous enough with me that you allowed that inner Norman to emerge and scream once in a while <laughs> <laughs> so that I could see how far I could go with this. Right. <laughs> well, I'm fascinated by your take on watching Richard change into this character. This is not a normal character for you to play usually. You're playing well, more the alpha It's not normal for anyone. I mean, this is a completely unique character. And for sure, I mean, it's a big distance for me to play him, but I, I think in reality it would be a big distance for anyone to play this guy. He's written a completely unique character. How, how was it to watch him transform in terms of body language, the way he carried himself, his, his interactions with others, his personal space? Was it I think, I think the, the biggest satisfaction that I have is when each, each scene has what the scene is about, but then there's this little nuance that has to do with what the character is really going through. And it usually has to do with his, this motivation that he has that no one else knows. He's trying to get close to someone. He's trying to introduce someone to someone. It's not the obvious thing. And seeing, Norm, seeing Richard grab on to that small nuance and bring it to life and express it in some way was incredibly satisfying to me because it's as if he was revealing this secret about what really goes through Norman's head. I remember him directing me. I'm flashing on one of the early scenes. It was actually the first scene that's in the movie. And I'm, uh, I'm approaching Dan Stevens in the park. And I got a deal. And I'm trying to convince him. But I remember we were doing the shot as, we, as he moves away. Because he basically does it. No <laughs> one wants anything to do with this Norman or any Norman. It's It's... How do you make them stop without using, losing your own dignity in making them stop? Yeah. <laughs> and you see that a lot with characters in this movie who just, they don't want to have to say, go away, leave me alone. It's, it's some level of, please, enough. So I'm chasing, I'm chasing, we're, we're doing a, tr a, a steady cam shot. And he's saying, I remember this direction was, you know, maybe you could just kind of bob behind him and try to get his attention. <laughs> Well, you're coming behind, and it, it was so, I mean, I got it immediately, what you were talking about. And that ended up informing much of what I did in the film, this sense right. of... Pe peeking, peeking over someone's <laughs> shoulder to, and just waving, I'm still here, is... is Hi. Seeing Richard Gere do that is incredibly satisfying. <laughs> Great, thank you. Thank you. That's excellent, thank you.